right. Marijuana needs to be legal. Oh, Marijuana needs to be legal. And there you go, all 50 states right away. I don't care what the how how the uh, Mexican cartels feel about it. I don't care about that. I don't care if you think it's the most dangerous drug on, on the planet for whatever dumb reason that you have. Oh my God, it's green. Oh my God, it's the color of my snot. Oh no. Oh, so the the danger, the danger that kids could get involved in this. Oh my God. Oh no. Oh no. No. people in prison for no reason doing it God made it vote yes on Ohio marijuana reform legalize it right now right now you gotta legalize it right now you got people in prison who didn't harm anybody they just grow a plant, or they grew a plant, they smoked something that was grown. Everybody grows stuff. Everybody grows stuff in America. I mean, I mean, what do you got? There's nothing you can say that's going to combat that. I mean, it's just, it, you let drug cartels making billions off of it. And then you wonder why you can't slow them down or whatever. And he knows all the part of it. It's a big agenda. It's a bigger, it's a bigger piece to the puzzle than them. It's bigger than them. Man, I had to take a drug test. And it pissed me off to know that the cocaine addict or an alcoholic could be more available for the job than I can when well because it's only it only lasts like what 72 hours for a co cocaine alcohol so it's okay it's, it's a okay cokehead gets the job after the first three days or after the first paycheck bye bye I quit I have to go get my fix And what? The alcoholic, he's in prison because he beat his, he blacked out and beat his wife. And Pothead was the most reliable, available person for the job the whole damn time. Because smoking a doobie on Saturday to relax isn't going to affect his work on Wednesday. So, it needs to be legalized. Matter of fact, you, you need to legalize all the drugs. You need to le legalize cocaine, too. And if they're addicted, you have to send them to somewhere where they can get real help. I'm talking about actual help. Like, actual rehab. Like, actual stuff that will actually try to get them to get off of it. Not prison. They'll still find their fix there. It doesn't matter. You just That's not how you... And their addiction by sending someone to prison. If you're addicted to cookies, if you, if you like Kool-Aid, if you're addicted to grape soda, then you should go to prison too. Anybody who's addicted to anything should go to prison, basically, is what you're saying to that whole logic. It needs to stop. Say yes to marijuana reform in, in Ohio. Let's legalize it in Ohio. Let's keep the train going. We're not going to stop until it's legal in all 50 states. We're not we're never going to stop. It's going to, always, it's going to always be here. It's always going to be around. You're not going to stop it from growing. It's always going to be around. God made it. You're not going to stop when God created it. You're not. It needs to be legal right away. It doesn't affect anybody's work unless they are high on the job, maybe. But if they're not, and then this, like he's, they're out of work. They're, I mean, it's, it's away from the workforce. And 
it doesn't affect their work when they're in in work time, then it's none of their damn business what they do outside of work when it's they they don't care that are they don't care anyway. They shouldn't. Nobody no no successful business should care about what's going on and the employees household as long as they can get the job done. It's none of their business if they can get the job done. If it affects their business, then it's their business, but if it doesn't affect their business, it's none of their damn business. So, legalize weed in all 50 states. So, yes, the marijuana reform in Ohio. So, and let's see if we can keep the train moving in all 50 states.